And so your bat stunner just didn't work? Nope. That's right. I have a bad feeling it was no accident. Alfred, get Lucius, Lucius on the line for me, please. Of course. Let's get a closer look at you. Uh, okay. Remove no damage on the microfiber. Adhesion regulation reads normal. So we can rotate it. Uh, remove the back panel. Electricity conductor. Everything looks functional. It should have worked. Remove the side panel. EMP functionality is all in the green. This doesn't make any sense. Circuit board. This is strange. This microchip is emitting a low bandwidth receiving signal, but it shouldn't be. <gasps> like We're the ones trapped. you shut down in the GCPD. Something like that. But Lucius had his eyes on the Wayne tag that the children of Arkham breached. This is something different. Bruce, I have Lucius on screen now. Good evening, Bruce. How can I help? I need you to see something. Sending you schematics. God. Someone's found a way to get past my security upgrades. Not just someone. Oswald Cobblepot. Bruce, I am so sorry. I should have caught this, but he snuck right under my nose. Oh, what a mess. But that Don't sleaze Cobblepot at the heart of it all. Cut yourself some slack, Lucius. There's no way you could have known. I certainly don't blame you for it. Well, I still feel a little guilty. <laughs> Looks to me like he's introduced some sort of bug into your network. That's how he's making my equipment malfunction? For now. But if he keeps it up, he could completely take control of your tech. My lord, that would be catastrophic. Is there anything you can do? I can try to work on your firewalls, but if I do anything too drastic, you'll know we're on to him. Um... Tread carefully. Cobblepot doesn't know we're on to him. We can't risk losing the element of surprise. I say you do what you need to do, as stealthily as possible. Good plan. I'll get on it right away. Thanks, Lucius. Bruce, you're going to want to see this. Uh, excuse us, Lucius. Of course. Reports of Children of Arkham activity are down. But these efforts do not come cheap. That's why I am say? formally seizing the Wayne Estate. Oh. So the corrupt wealth of Gotham's elite can go to the better purpose of protecting Gotham's common man. Mr. Wayne has 24 hours to evacuate his property and turn it over to the city. Or he will be removed. <laughs> You can't let that egomaniac throw us out on the street. I have to talk to him. Harvey is scared, paranoid, but he clearly views Batman in a favorable light. True. And again, maybe talking to an old friend is what he needs. Oh God, we gotta decide. Harvey's to go behavior is unpredictable, random. Who knows how he will react either way? Um. The thing is, I don't want to tarnish Batman's name, so I think we're gonna go this as Bruce. This is Bruce's Bruce. problem, not Batman's. I'll take care of it. I believe in you, Bruce. I know you can get through to him. Uh, that was probably the wrong decision, but <laughs> if we're role-playing, <laughs> that was the decision I wanted to make. I don't know if that was the right thing to do. Why did I do that? Don't screw this up, Harvey. Harvey, we need to talk. If you've come to save your home, you're wasting your time. My mind is made up. We were friends. I have always supported you. You were my friend. Tell me, Bruce, were you thinking about our friendship when you were <laughs> screwing Selena? Look, I know you're still pissed off at me about sleeping with Selena. I get it. But this has to stop. Now. Gotham deserves a mayor that can focus on cleaning up this city. That's why I'm taking your money, your home, everything. It's time that you started paying your debt to Gotham. For the value of your estate, it could be used to do a I'll lot of good. I'll do it on good. my terms. I'll pay this city back on my terms. 
not yours. Nah. I think I like my terms better. Dick? I'm sorry, Bruce. But I can't back down now. I've got a lot of pressure on me right now. I've got your enemies everywhere. And strong leaders crush their enemies. Without hesitation. I made a promise to the city that I would make it better. We're having to put a dent in crime. I out the crime and corruption. Boy, you are really living up to your campaign slogan, aren't you? Put a dent in crime. Oh, I'm living up to it, all right. I'm about to put a dent in crime so large, it'll change the face of Gotham forever. <laughs> the children of Arkham won't know what hit them. What are you talking about? Ready to go. Do it. What the hell did you do? Our Lady Arkham's drugs destroyed. That blast was way bigger than you said! We must have taken out a whole city block with it! Hey, man, we lost a bunch of our own guys! The apartment next door! Oh, Jesus Christ! We stopped the children of Arkham. That's all that matters. Harvey. That's what a leader does. You killed innocent people. What? <laughs> you How killed... quickly can we get a fire truck here? Does a leader kill innocent people? You're a murderer now. Their deaths are unfortunate. But think about everyone the children of Arkham could have hurt with those drugs. That feels like an acceptable price to it's pay. It's not. I couldn't just destroy the drugs. I had to make a statement. I needed the children of Arkham and any other potential enemies waiting in the shadows to know what I'm capable of. Then I'll do anything to protect my city. Gotham will turn against you. After what you've done tonight, everyone in Gotham is going to see who they really elected mayor. And when that happens, they will turn against you. On the contrary, Bruce, this is what Gotham wanted. Oh, I can see tomorrow's headlines already. Hero Mayor saves citizens from Children of Arkham Terror Plot. Meanwhile, delusional. somewhere in the back they'll stick the article about Bruce Wayne's tragic suicide. What? What the hell are you talking about? You're gonna push us off the All building? All the shame you've suffered was just too much for you to bear. Your family's history, getting forced out of your company, losing all your money. No one will question finding you dead in Crime Alley so soon after you got out of Arkham. Tragic, but unsurprising. He's gonna threaten him. I don't if wanna you punch kill him. Me, you better make sure I'm dead. <laughs> because if not, what I did to Cobblepot will look like child's play. <laughs> Good to know. Oh. Are you being murdered? <laughs> I hope not. This episode is so Come on, good. Keep walking. Wait. Shut up. Just wait. Just keep moving. Uh, why are you doing this? Please. Why are you doing this? Hey, he said shut up. Cops protect people. You're cops! You're supposed to protect people. Keep them safe! Is this really what your badge stands for? This is how we're keeping people safe. We just blew up the an entire of block. Are trying to tear the city apart. We're saving it. Yeah, we finally got a leader who wants results. You sound brainwashed. Listen to yourself. You sound brainwashed. No. It brainwashed us. We're helping it. We're doing the right thing. The mayor is the only one brave enough to take real action against our enemies. What about Batman? Your mayor just blew up a city block. Sometimes to help the greater good, there's a price to pay. People died. Your fellow officers died. I... I... But if you think that's where he's going to stop, you're just as crazy as he is. I... Uh... Maybe, uh, maybe he has a point. Shut up! You just don't get it! You don't understand! That's why we need to take you out. Maybe, maybe what? Think for uh, yourselves. Nothing. Just think for yourselves. You're not Harvey's puppets. You are more than This that. isn't about the mayor. This is about protecting the city. And that's why we're not afraid to do what it takes. 
Officer! Oh. Drop your weapon! Gordon! You okay? Yeah. You really showed up in the nick of time. How'd you even find me? Den just blew up a whole city block. I know, I know. The reports I'm hearing are just awful. Den's gone way, way too far. He's supposedly trying to stop the children of Arkham, but now he's become a goddamn terrorist himself. A terrorist with half the city's support behind him. God, the amount of blood on his hands. How could this He happen? and Lady Arkham might be neck and neck on body count by this point. I just don't understand how this could happen. He's not emperor. He's just mayor. He's declared martial law. Basically, whatever he says goes, if he believes it's for the good of the city. I can't help but feel guilty. Batman gave me the information on where to find Lady Arkham's drug stockpile. I hand it into my superiors and... God, this happens. I'm trying to figure out what I can do to help. But I feel like my hands are tied every direction I turn. Grogan's out for Batman's head. As soon as he can figure out a way to do it. Clean up the DCPD. I've never felt this frustrated with a system in my entire career. Sounds to me like you're already on the right path. Weeding the bad seeds out of the department. Cutting down the enforcers. Yeah, I just hope it'll be enough. Everything is such a goddamn mess. Do you need a ride? Thanks, but I've got it taken care of. <laughs> the Batmobile.